Hey guys, it's Cast 246 here, playing some Neo Scavenger. It's a post-apocalyptic scavenging game. Now you might wonder, be wondering if you ever played this game before, why are we right here? Uh, OBS just crashed on me, and I really did not feel like going back through that. And plus, it wasn't really like anything happened. Basically, in the beginning, you wake up disoriented, and you notice that there's a creature coming from the hallway, and you, you know you gotta get out. So, as I was explaining before, I freaking crashed the game because I forgot how to exit menus. Um, over here are the actions. We end our turn because we do only have points. You can run. You can hide. Hide your tracks, which, you know, stops people. You can spy, you know, and scavenge. So, and it is, over here is all our stats and stuff. You can see we're unhurt. We're getting cold because only have a hospital gown on. We're comfortable, though, which is nice. We're unburdened, and we're well-rested, which is both going down for some odd reason. Wait, what is this? Oh, we have a bronze talisman on a braided leather string. That's great. We are fine, you know, we're sated hunger, and we have slaked thirst. So we are good to go before I press the, almost press the escape key again, and that would have crashed the game, or not the game, but OBS. All right, so we're in this town. It's a bunch of trailers and houses, so we're going to scavenge. Yeah, okay then. Um, An abandoned, all right, let's go for the storage shed first. Loot, all right, so you can see here this is how the looting system works get a little um, description up here of what's in but you know blah 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 so you see here the safety of the location the sneak which is you know how much noise you'll be making of course and the loot now we can use our stats that we chose which I'll show that off in a second I actually forgot about that we can use our ability or our uh, trait strong to scavenge brutishly which increases loot but decreases safety and sneak alright so we found some items so we're gonna go here. We found an empty can. Ooh, a wrench. I'm gonna put that. We're gonna equip that. Also got a lighter. So we're gonna put that there. The ice slab tablet. Empty out. Ice slab battery. All right. Um. Makeshift sack. What? Can I wear this? Oh, I have the dar. All right, so yeah, here, put that like that. Can I? All right, now we do have to drag it in. All right, so sorry, I'm still kind of relearning the game. I haven't played in a while. Sure, I'll take this with as well. Um, put that in there. Do we get in? No, we don't. All right, I'm gonna leave that there then. So we have a makeshift sketch, all that stuff. All right. Um, where is it at? Where do I show off my? All right, right here. Chosen abilities, we have Eagle Eye, you can see one hex further, strong, melee, and medic. If you want to read those, pause the video. Insomniac, self-explanatory. You know, again, if you want to read it, pause the video. Honestly, I really don't feel like reading all that because it's kind of, you know, repetitive and self-explanatory. So now we're going to explore the second location. We can actually use our lighter and strong. So it severely reduces the sneak, but we get a lot better chance at loot. And even so, we found nothing whatsoever. So that is wonderful. So we're going to move down here, move down here, move the camera over. So now we're in a abandoned city, it looks like. So we will end our turn first because we're out of movements. Now that we have movements left over, we can scavenge this. Oh boy, this is actually really nice. So we're going to have a nice amount of stuff here to loot. Nothing. Oh, I actually think I just said something about our activity um, bringing people to us. Typically likely in alerted nearby creatures. All right, yeah. So it doesn't actually say there's somebody coming. It's just that it probably alerted people. Nice, we got stuff this time. Ooh, all right. This is actually really good. Wait, hold on, wait. Let me check the quality of this. This is 51, 66. All right, so this is better. All right, so we got blue. All right, eight percent. Yeah, no, thank you. All right, good. We can put these on then too. Here, actually, I'm gonna take that off. Take off the hospital gown at this point and put it ah never mind we'll keep it on screw it um what is this green duffel bag all right we're actually going to empty all this out to here and switch out the makeshift sack for the duffel bag put all this in here and we can do that to rearrange it real quick we also have a plastic sled bottle Ooh, all right, good. These these bottles actually have some pain medicines in them, which is nice. 
Um, we could. I'm actually gonna take the empty bottles because they come in handy for when you need to carry liquids, of course. Um, scrap of foil. I don't really think we'll need that. Um, all right. Yeah, that should be good there. Now, next thing we I really want to find would be some shoes. That would be great. If we could find some shoes. Nope, nothing. All right, and our turn because we're out of. Yep, we're shivering. That's to be expected. Um, walking around in the wet probably does not help when you have no um, no shoes. You know, so nothing good. All right, just rearrange that to make it a little bit easier to see what's going on. You scrap a paper. It reads tool scope with straps. One small binocular object. Yeah, sure, we'll take that. Um, that seems to be it. And if I remember correctly, yep, yep, that was the last thing to get there. So we're going to continue to move on. Move over here, and their turn. Ooh, all right. Starting to get lighter out. We're able to see farther. There might be some stuff here that we can scavenge. So open field. Nothing. All right. We're going to come over here, scavenge this, and we're going to scavenge the first building. Nothing. All right. In turn. Now the point of this game is that at some point you will notice a distant glowing city in the nighttime, and it is basically your objective to get there and do different stuff. All right, that's right. It doesn't come in pairs of shoes in this game. You actually got to get the individual right and left, and that's a little annoying sometimes. There we go. We got a shirt on now too. It's a little annoying. Don't get me wrong, but you know it adds to the realism. So at least we can say that. What is this? Weapon, gauss, rifle, scope, and add a strap, Phillips head screwdriver, medium thread. Yeah, I'm not taking that. Um, this is 3 point three six point. Oh, yeah, this is some really nice clothing, let me tell you. Let me tell you, dude, the clothing in this game, mm, it's like Gucci. It's like Louis Vuitton, you know what I mean? Oh, what is this? I never scratched UVD? What? All right. Patrick Hyde tunic. Yeah, it's about to break, so no thanks. Uh, mending fences in the wake of growing so security concerns US countries become unprecedented uh, seeing ramp ups in both security forces alright yeah I don't care I'm going to take this off with our shirt alright I'm going to switch this shirt out because this shirt has more alright I already saw that <clears throat> switched out the shirts because the shirt has more condition which means it will last longer which will help all right, found some more stuff. Let's rearrange this. Um, found another left shoe. All right, switching that one out. I mean, at least we're finding some shoes. That's good. At least we know there's still shoes in the area. And I just unfull screened again. Um, video's probably gonna look a little weird now, but honestly, at this point, I am not going to re-full screen it because that is how OBS crashes, and I did it again. Not crashing it, but this is what I did last time by accident. So enjoy this. We're going to be doing it this way. Ooh, over there, as you can see. I'm not used to that being over there now. Ooh, all right. We got some stuff. We can search the shack in the forest, right? We're going to use our strength and our lighter. Ooh, what did we get? Crowbar with strap? Yeah, dude, I'm going to take this. I'll rearrange that. I'm actually going to put this. Wait, 8.8. Yeah, no, thank you. All right, put this here. Got a phone. All right. Ooh, got some multi-tool pocket knives. We can put that in there. All right. That's pretty good so far, if you know what I mean. That's, you know, nice to see. Nice loot. So we can actually use the crowbar. We're going to use this one that I don't have equipped. And strong. And the lighter. Stumbled into a patch of black mold. irritated causing discomfort like an allergy ah oh, that is not good um nasal allergies shit and I don't think hopefully I won't um you know cause us to die that would be great if it were to not cause us to die because I have no other way to heal myself right now okay again we're just gonna try to all right there we go there's that shoe that we needed, even though it's about to freaking fall apart. 
Nope, that's nothing. Nope, that doesn't have anything in it either. Great. Um, 85, what are you at? 92. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna keep the two shoes on. What can we do in here? That's right, we can build stuff. Um, Alright, we're fine. We're good. We have no longer have nasal allergies going on because of the black mold. Which I'm sure would do a lot more than cause nasal allergies, but if the game's gonna, you know, be like that, I won't. Nothing, nothing. All right, that's that's all right, I guess. Um, it's give me a load of load of bullshit. That's cool. You gonna give me something good? Am I gonna have to just cry myself to sleep? All right, might give me something good here. Rearrange this. Um, nope. Um, bunch of more bullshit. <laughs> What is this? Uh, food, meat from small, medium, furry corpse. Sharp edge of small, medium, furry corpse. I'm actually going to take that to remember that. Alright. And I cannot move my mouse correctly. 48%. Yeah. Actually, I'm actually going to take all three of the lighters, TBH. Just to have them. Corn to coal. Yeah, it's all empty. So we should be done in this spot. Let me check the time. It's actually just about time to wrap this up. So what we're going to do is we're going to end turn. All right. Nobody's coming to break our heads open. That's great. So what I am going to do. Ooh, all right. What I am going to do is I am going to actually end the video here. And I will bid you guys a farewell. I hope you enjoyed the video. I am sorry for the poor quality of it, um, recording quality. I am still kind of, I'm still messing around with the settings with OBS and all that, you know, all that shit. Um, I actually like how it's like, like it has a little shout out to Project Zomboy. That's actually a game I might check out. Um, I have it, don't like I own it, but I've never really gotten into it because it is a very in-depth game. But if that's something you guys want to see, and I'm sure not many of you are going to see this, but that's whatever at this point. I really don't care. I'm doing this for fun, not for views. Um, if you guys want to see that, you know, and you do see this video, just let me know. Although, most likely, if I get into Project Zomboid anytime soon, I will record it either way. But I hope you guys have a great day. This is Cast246, signing out.